Hey, what is up guys? This is iCrazy like Teddy bringing you guys another GTA 5 online video and in today's video guys what I'm bringing you is a highly anticipated money glitch after the 1.07 patch allowing you to resell cars as much times as you want. So guys if you do enjoy this video don't be shy and hit that like button and also subscribe if you want to see more top notch GTA 5 glitches. Okay guys so to begin this glitch what you're going to want to do is make sure you guys do have a full garage and from there guys make sure you do have a z-type in it as well okay because I noticed that this glitch works great with the z-type. So yeah, as you guys can see, I've got the Z-Type just right there in front of me. So what you're going to want to do is open up your phone, go to Travel and Transport, head over to the Z-Type and click on it. And from there, choose the color of the car. And then from there, what you guys are going to want to do is click on Order. And since your garage is full, it will ask you to replace a car. So click X or A once on any single car. And be sure not to press it twice because that will obviously replace the car. So once you chose the car, I've got an invisible hot knife. When it says, are you sure you want to replace this vehicle? What you're going to want to do is press start and then press your press your left trigger or L1 on the PlayStation. And then go over to the PlayStation or Xbox Live store. And as soon as you guys have launched the store, what you're going to want to do is just keep rapidly pressing the A on the Xbox 360 or uh, X on the th uh, PlayStation 3. So as soon as you've clicked on PlayStation or Xbox Live store, keep smashing that X or A button. And when the PlayStation or Xbox Live Store uh, does load, all you have to do, guys, is just go ahead and back out from there. Also, guys, I'd just like to add this glitch was found by a really good mate of mine. His name is Granty, official Granty. His channel link will be in the description. If you guys will be uploading this glitch to your channel, if you guys are going to do it and maybe post some gameplay, then please feel free to leave his link in the description because he is the founder. Anyway guys, from there you, what you're going to want to do is return to your garage if you did get kicked out, which you most likely will. And as you guys can see, it's just a clusterfuck and these uh, Z-types are just like falling everywhere. Now what you're going to want to do is get into one of the duplicated ones. Sometimes it doesn't let you get, uh, get in, so from there you'll have to do the glitch again. I don't know why there's three here, there normally should be two, but yeah. So from here guys, once you do manage to get into one of the Z-Types or whatever car you did do this glitch with, once again it does work the best with the Z-Type. What you guys are going to want to do is um, just drive it over to Los Santos Customs and from there just sell the Z-Type. You guys can do upgrades on it or whatever you want, it doesn't really matter, that's just time consuming I guess um, to add all the upgrades, it's really personal preference. Also, the question you guys are all probably asking is, is there a certain amount of time you have to wait before doing this glitch? And the answer to that is no, you don't have to wait like 48 minutes before reselling the car and doing this glitch all over again. As you guys can see, I'm just going to sell it here. And then from there, I'll show you guys um, what I did two minutes later when I returned back to my garage and did the glitch over with my boy Granty again. Once again, I'd just like to thank him. He is the founder of this glitch and he also helped me do this and I never really understood it until he told me what to do. Also, another thing, uh, while you're doing the glitch, you must always have someone in your garage to make sure none of the cars glitch out or anything. So yeah, that was another big reason why I had Granty helping me. So just get your mate to stay in your garage at all times and hopefully the glitch will work fine. Anyway lads, I am sorry to say it, but this is the end of this video. Anyway guys, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys want, then you can go ahead and click that like button. It'd be highly appreciated. And also guys, if you want to see more GTA 5 money glitches such as this one, maybe new ways, maybe this was too complicated, then hit that subscribe button. My name is iCrazyTeddy and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace!